21 matches, 21 days, and now the final is upon us. Welcome, everyone. The African Nations Cup decided here this evening in the National Stadium. It is Nigeria up against Burkina Faso. Ambrose again with a header. Diakite, he spilt it. It's over the top. Great chance for Nigeria. Idea profiting from some poor goalkeeping. Uche, wide out for Onanze. Now Moses, stumbling a little bit, but look at the burst of pace from Moses. And again, the goalkeeper is not convincing. Now Banse, we haven't seen much of him in this game. Banse with a shot. The first real effort in anger from Burkina Faso. They gave him a bit of room here. He is a striker in the Bundesliga in Germany, so he's no mug in front of goal. It looks like someone is going to run in and try and hit it as hard as possible. It's Banse who goes this wide. So two shots in the matter of three minutes from uh, Aristide Banse. Back post chance, yeah! And the header from Koulibaly, or from Kone rather, is wide. There's Ike Uche now, with an opportunity inside here for Moses. He's going to shoot, and it's blocked by Kone. He has the follow-up from Mbar, Mbar, he scores! Nigeria have the lead, and Sunday Mbar scores his second of the tournament. Five minutes to half time, and they've broken the deadlock. Banse Nakumwa. Offside. Oh, for a moment there, looked as if Burkina Faso were on for the equaliser. It's his natural inclination to hang out on the wing. Replacing uh, Emenike. Moses, the turn here from Idea. Tight angle. Oh, that was close. Great turn from Brown Idea. The second goal almost on for Nigeria. Let's see how close he came. Gets past Corne. And the goalkeeper must be given some credit there. Counter attack chance here for Nigeria. Yes, Moses. It's two against two. Moses waits for Musa. Moses, he tries to pick his spot. And that's perhaps a waste of chance for Nigeria. Flick on by Banse. On Nanze, he's got uh, Musa peeling off. He's got Moses in support. Chance for the second. Ahmed Musa trips as he gets the ball for Moses. He fell over his own feet. Nakuma. Still Nakuma. Sano. Oh, it's just gone wide. Snapshot from the substitute. Pace of Ahmed Musa. Square ball. Oh, Kabore set it up here for Idea. Surely. Well, sometimes they're on a little bit of a suicide mission, the Burkinabe. Great one, two. Musa Rinaldi. The keepers missed it. And so did Brian Idea. Floated in, up comes Anyema. Will we have a new champion in a second or two? Yes, we will. Nigeria have won the Orange Africa Cup of Nations. Joseph Yobo will have the honor. Issa Hayatu says, you hand it over, Mr. President. Joseph Yobo has the trophy. Nigeria are champions of Africa.
That's the man I was talking about, James Fury. He had a thigh injury. Managed to get him back into harness again for this game. A lot of uh, European coaches and scouts out here. Although John Fashner was saying he hasn't come across an English agent yet, which he finds rather surprising. Going away with their Equivern. Now I think significantly again for Nigeria. As that's picked up by Amokachi. Fini D, it's a tempting one, Yakini. Where was the marking? And the goalkeeper, Fili, fumbling that. The Dutchman, coach of Nigeria, looking on anxiously. The next corner, Rufai hesitating, brilliant goal! Litana! And a shock start to this game. What I talked about, nerves. Surely this Nigerian defence suffering there. Look, a clutch of white jerseys, the goalkeeper on the line. He didn't go for it. And up went Litana, solidly into the back of the net. Four minutes gone. And surprisingly, Zambia in the lead. Wonderful jump by the defender, did very well indeed. Elijah Litana, his first goal of the tournament. And now Nigeria have got to come out. Pushed back there by Olise. Well then, quite clearly, Nigeria missing the presence of Stephen Keshi in midfield. He's on the bench this afternoon. He really is the captain of the side. Okafor, the substitute captain this afternoon. And Keshi troubled with a thigh injury as well. This is Nigeria fighting back on that. A thrust there by Amoniki, Emmanuel Amoniki, only 20 years of age. And one of the young crop of talent coming through for Nigeria. Well, I'm quite sure the Nigerian players are smarting under that blow. They didn't expect that one. Up and over, that's equaliser! The goal coming so quickly there from the man I was mentioning, Amonike. Five and a half minutes gone, Nigeria are back on level terms. A drooping header there, should have been covered. And Amonike coming in from the left, neat positioning, and just puts it away. I think it may have come off uh, Litana himself there, it didn't matter, it was bound for the back of the net. And what a marvellously entertaining start we've had to this match. Two goals in the opening five minutes. Well, I did say at the start of this tournament, I was a little bit worried about some of the negative play we saw. That was partly due to the organisation of the tournament, which meant it was rather easy uh, for teams to read exactly what they had to do to... One thing is very clear from this tournament, the African nations have learned how to defend and sometimes it's forgotten that if the Cameroon knew how to defend well, then he wouldn't have lost that famous game they had with England. And Zambia certainly proving good organisation, except they can cut there! Zambia in the lead, a couple of goals now for Amonike. And like any defence, well organised, occasionally licking. And really exposed there as Amoniki picked his spot in the net. Well, we had a marvellous start to the first half. And now a repeat. Only one man at the back there, left on his own, Malatoli. The goalkeeper, a superb goalkeeper, quite exposed. And Nigeria, the favourites, are now 2 1 up. Replacing the other Bwalia. Related, of course. 26 years of age, Johnson Bwalia. Westerhoff signalling instructions there. Oh, I think you'll be happy of Nigeria 
can hold on to this like the skills of Amma Katja and there's a driving shot there Samson Siasia now about five minutes ago I said he'd been absolutely anonymous in the second half and he stepped out out of the shadow into the sun with that blistering shot a very good save indeed the man from FC Nantes in France that whilst they've had much more possession in midfield that they have this kind of power the shooting power the running power we've seen it from um, different sources Siasia, Yakini and Okocha Sakala well, that's what I said about the daintiness of the football, but it's broken up in that rugged defensive wall of Nigeria. That's better. This is the skilled man in the team of Kocha. Looks for the one-two. It's a great effort there. Oh, no, that's more like Nigeria. Wonderful little run. Great control. He had left his man for dead in midfield. Got the one-two on, and then a dreadful finish there by Amaniki this is where it all started drifting away from defenders and now the attack by Salietti at the other end and the game has come alive again after all that uh, neutral benign play in midfield Nigeria doing absolutely nothing in midfield just now. They're, all they're doing is defending. And what they'll hope to do is hit the long ball towards Yakini. Well, that's a dangerous one. Great save, isn't it? No. Brilliant piece of play there by Zambia. An instinctive save there. Hooked round by Malatoli. And down at the second effort there by Rufai. Now, this is the save that really mattered. The first one, as Malatoli got his toe to it. And then he gets the protection of the referee. Very good piece of goalkeeping. No time to think there. Unfortunate for Malatoli. And when time's running out, so also sometimes truly does your luck. Free kick. They'll have to rush to take it. We're into stoppage time in the African Nations Cup final, as you can see. And that's a, a wise move. Just hit it to the far end of the field. That's all they're required to do. Time is against them. We've seen a particularly courageous fight in the second half. Kalusha, tempting ball, just a trifle too near Peter Rufai. Well, whenever this man has been put to the test, he hasn't been found wanting. Good in the air and one or two good instinctive saves. Zambia, who have never won this trophy, are now playing in stoppage time 2-1 down to Nigeria Nigeria were beaten in the final in 1984, 88 and 90 but not this one Nigeria are the new champions of Africa onto the field come their entourage of supporters of officials and there their very tuneful support Clemens Westerhoff the coach who really must have been in tenterhooks throughout the second half as Zambia had so much of the play is now a relieved man up go the Nigerian players delighted with themselves let's start I've given a lot of credit to Zambia for the way they fought hard started and we spent some 30 seconds into the game this play has been even so far with both sides uh, giving very good account of themselves Christian Chuku there for Nigeria 
long thrust. Mudalawal is up front there. I think he's playing a different role here this afternoon. I think Mudalawal is being made to strike this afternoon. Mudalawal, you remember, had the best scoring average all through the league series in 1979. Throw in, coming to Nigeria. Amesimaka. That's what Adabami. And it's in the net. It is a goal. Shaku got it. Can we take a look at that goal again? This is glorious. Let's take a look at that goal again. Well, play, players started again. Maybe we'll see that another time. Algerians now back on the ball. Felix Owolabi. Mudalawa. Mudalawa. Shegu again. Shegu is beaten this time. Outside left, Assad Salah. The Algerians were really stunned by that. Throw into Nigeria. Tafa. That's uh, Bella Kadar. A good pass to Salad on the outside left position. A very, that's a lucky break for Nigeria. Still Salad. Still moving on that touchline. I, I thought somebody handled the ball there, but play continues and Shegu is with the ball now. Shegu beat him, nice and proper. Shegu is still going on. This is skillful. A chance. Bellum is still on with the ball. Asad Salah comes to help him out of that dangerous situation. He tries to beat three people in a row. He couldn't get past. Now Shegun Otegbami, a pass. And a through one for him. He has one man to beat. He beats him and he's on on his own. Kuchi running on fast. But Otegbami beats Kuchi. And a good one there. Oh no! Muta wasted it again. It takes possession, but Aloysius is behind him and he takes it off for the Eagles. Adoki now. Missed a miss of legs, he gets through. Muda, over blow. Adoki, Adoki trying to get a one pass off a defender. And he goes on, Owolabi now. Felix Owolabi, he beats his man, he's almost been pushed and he doesn't let it go. And the header puts it over the bar from Ali Fegani, a corner kick. Mustafa Kucha, Belumi. Through one and a straight one to Bensula. He shouldn't be allowed to get onto that. He does. He beats and it's over the line. He takes a very good chip. Waiting for a mystic. And a good one. Shagwa Degwami and he puts it in there again. It is a goal. Shagwa's second goal. Nations and for the first time, the cup of unity is at stake. Good header, Ben Miluti. Ali Fregani, that interception from Wolabi for the Eagles and Aloysius. They're finding their feet a little bit easier this time. And a heel back for Wolabi. Back again to Adoki. Somebody thought it was offside or it was out of play there. Adoki is still going on. And a heel back to Wolabi. This is good combination. Squaring. And it's in there again. Muta made it this time. Muta made it. Four minutes. Four minutes into the second half. And a really well worked goal. With Adiele. And now Shegun Odegbami. Almost being hacked down from behind. Kuchi was doing that. Now Shegun finding wings on that far side. He turns around saying, I can do it. And the back pass to David Adiele. He gives it now to Kadiri Ikana. Aloysius. Oh, a bad pass. And the Algerians have missed it again. So, Adoki, a Messi Maka. Aloysius. And okay, Isima. Okay, Isima. And he's still going on. That's good squaring. A header. And it's almost got No! That was the chance by Fogba. Alone. Kana. This is Africa Cup final. And Nigerians are having a really satisfying moment. Aloysius. No, no, that's David. Beautiful play there by Muda. He just can't seem to take it easy. Muda is still going. Ooh. But for that little lapse, Muda was going to waltz himself right into the net. He got a corner kick for it anyway. Well, 
that is the long blast of the whistle to formally end the 12 African Cup of Nations. Uh, the main bowl. This has been the most successful match Nigeria has played in all this series. Yes, that's it. That is the president of the nation shaking the rattler. It's a really hysterical moment out here at the National Stadium. Fair Play Cup being presented, and the Fair Play Cup was won by Nigeria. Now the giant one. 